Hi everyone, this is your biology class. I am your teacher Seema Atreja. Students, in this lecture we are going to discuss the last topic that is cell division related to chapter fundamental unit of life. So, we will talk about cell division. Two types of cell division we will discuss here. Mitosis and meiosis what is mitosis we called it as equational division why we called it as equational division when mitosis division takes place number of chromosomes remains equal in daughter cells as present in parental cell so we called mitosis as equational division basically mitosis division takes place for growth and development of organism second type of division is meiosis we called meiosis as reductional division why we called it as reductional division as number of chromosomes reduced to half in daughter cell after meiosis division if the parental cell consist of 46 number of chromosomes after meiosis division daughter cell consist of only 23 chromosomes so it is a reductional division which reduces the chromosome number to half in the daughter cells meiosis division generally takes place in germ cell two types of cells are present in body somatic cell and germ cells germ cells participate in reproduction in germ cell meiosis division takes place and gametes are produced so for gamete formation meiosis division takes place let us understand this process clearly during sexual reproduction 
what happens two parents are involved one is father and the other is mother germ cells present in father and germ cell also present in mother what happens first step in sexual reproduction is gamete formation takes place and for gamete formation meiosis division takes place meiosis is a reductional division which reduce the chromosome number to half here we are talking about human being in each cell of the human being there are present 46 chromosome so meiosis division takes place in germ cells of human being in case of father when meiosis division takes place in germ cell male gametes are produced because meiosis division takes place and it is reductional division so it reduces the chromosome number to half so in the male gamete there is present only 23 chromosome similarly in case of mother meiosis division takes place in germ cell and female gamete is produced in female gamete also the chromosome number reduced to half because of meiosis division in germ cell 46 number of chromosome are present so in case of female gamete 23 chromosomes are present so meiosis takes place during the gamete formation it is known as reductional division which reduces the chromosome number to half now what happens fusion and male fusion of male and female gamete takes place the process is known as fertilization when male gamete fuses with female gamete a single cell zygote is produced inside the zygote 23 chromosome comes from the male gamete and 23 comes from the female gamete so in zygote 46 number of chromosome are present now growth and development takes place in zygote and for growth and development in zygote mitosis division takes place so mitosis takes place when growth and development is required it is a equational division the chromosome number remains the same in the daughter cells mitosis division takes place in zygote it is single cell first mitosis division takes place two cells are formed then further divide four cells are formed then eight cell structure 16 cell structure 32 cell structure 64 cell structure cells are going to double by each mitosis division and finally zygote converted into embryo by mitosis division so mitosis division takes place when growth and development is required it is equational division every cell develops from the zygote by mitosis division consist of the 46 chromosome as present in zygote so two types of division exist in nature mitosis and meiosis mitosis is equational division which takes place for growth and development after mitosis division chromosome number remains same in the daughter cells as present in the parental cell but meiosis is reductional division which reduces the chromosome number to half meiosis takes place in germ cell it takes place for gamete formation normally what happens in case of unicellular organism
यूनिसेलर ऑर्गेनिज्म आर मेड अप ऑफ सिंगल सेल इफ सेल डिविजन टेक्स प्लेस इन यूनिसेलर ऑर्गेनिज्म लाइक अमीबा देन टू सेल्स आर प्रोड्यूस्ड इट मीन्स इन यूनिसेलुलर ऑर्गेनिज्म इन यूनिसेलुलर ऑर्गेनिज्म लाइक अमीबा सेल डिविजन इज द मेथड ऑफ रिप्रोडक्शन जब भी यूनिसेल ऑर्गेनिज्म में सेल डिवाइड करेगी तो दो सेल्स की फॉर्मेशन होगी दो सेल्स में टू ऑर्गेनिज्म आर प्रोड्यूस्ड तो यूनिसेलर ऑर्गेनिज्म में सेल डिविजन का मेथड ही क्या है रिप्रोडक्शन का मेथड है दिस इज ऑल अबाउट इन दिस वीडियो थैंक यू सो मच